Right guys, we have a pretty interesting report today that says the iPhone 14 Pro series could be available with a whopping two terabytes of storage. And so let's delve into the likelihood of this happening, but first make sure to like and subscribe for the latest Apple news and rumors. And with that being said, let's just tuck in. Right, so this report is coming from my drivers. They're not very credible, so do take the information with a grain of salt. Anyways, delving into the report, you might be wondering, does this make any sense? Well, let's delve into why this could happen and why this might not happen. Right, so beginning with why this wouldn't happen, there's two main reasons. Number one, this is an early iPhone 14 leak, and in the past, early iPhone leaks have always been completely wrong. But the second point I want to mention is that if you take a look at past iPhone refreshes, you might notice Apple gives us new storage tiers every two to three years. For example, we got one terabyte this year, but 512 was introduced with the iPhone XS, and then before that, 256 debuted on the iPhone 7. And so since Apple just gave us one terabyte, one does expect Apple to retain the same storage tiers for the next generations of iPhone before moving on to two terabytes. But now let's delve into why this could happen and it's mainly due to the camera upgrades we could see with the iPhone 14. So of course, Minchi Kuo has told us we can expect a new 48 megapixel main sensor on the iPhone 14 Pro series. And of course, this is going to be capturing way more data and so with features like Pro Raw and Pro Res, I can see why someone would need 2 terabytes. Also do remember that with a much larger sensor we could see 8K recording on the iPhone and so all these camera features combined definitely needs more storage. Also in this report from my drivers, they say that Apple is going to be using a new storage tech to achieve 2 terabytes on the iPhone and surprisingly this has been backed up by another source Digitimes, though to be fair Digitimes is not the most credible source out there. But anyways, what do I think is going to happen? Well, to be honest, because of the camera upgrades, we can expect on the iPhone 14, I can see that alone, justifying the need for a two terabyte storage option. I do also wanna say that if we do see two terabytes, I could also see them doubling the base storage to 256, since number one, that could incentivize more people to get the pros over the regular models, but more importantly, there is a 1080p cap with the 128 gig models this year with ProRes, and so I think the right move would be to eliminate that storage option. But of course, I'm sure Timothy also loves that juicy profit, upselling people right now to the 256 models, so I guess we shall wait and see. But tell me how much storage you guys use in the comments below. Anyways, thank you for watching guys, make sure to like and subscribe for the latest Apple news and rumors. Check out the video in the cut above on details regarding the iPad Air 5. And on that note, I'll see you guys in the next one. See ya peeps.